Om Shanti, welcome to 17th of November's Holy Blessing. Supreme Father says, May you be a master, bestower and sow the seeds of your good wishes in all souls. God says, Do not wait for the fruit, but continue to sow the seeds of your good wishes in every soul. So do not wait for any kind of physical appraisal or non-physical appraisal like name, fame and uh, any kind of uh, uh, praises. So both the things should not be expected. But still keep on doing the good that is. Best to the seeds of good wishes in every soul. All souls definitely have to awaken at the right time. Whether they listen to you now or they don't. The right time will come. Even if someone is causing opposition, you must not let go of your merciful feelings. Don't get agitated. Don't get irritated. Don't call names. Don't take revenge. No. That opposition, those insults and that defamation will work like fertilizer and bear good fruit. So God is comparing all that with muck, right? So if somebody is throwing muck at you, it will slip down and then it will be useful to us because it will become like a fertilizer. That means you will get energy from there only. To the extent that they defame you, to that extent they will sing your praise. Why? Because the defamation is coming from a past accumulation of karma accounts. So it's reducing. Every time they defame you, it's reducing. It's getting down. And then... What else do they have to give you then? Nothing. So once the past karmas and past life defamations are given, they have got nothing more to hate you for. Then what will happen? Slow, slow neutrality and then praises. To the extent that they defame you, to that extent they will sing your praise and this is why you as a master bestower must continue to bestow good wishes on, <coughs> excuse me, on every soul through your attitude, vibrations, it means your thoughts, and words to do that is a great achievement and if you can do this for a period of time you'll be a very light-hearted and like-minded soul om shanti